A striped t-shirt, a blurred footage of a striped t-shirt helped solve a murder mystery in Delhi in this week's Crime Fights. The Delhi police solved the murder of a 25-year-old woman in Northeast Delhi with the help of a blurry CCTV image showing a passenger wearing a striped t-shirt and white trousers. On April 12, the police received a call reporting a woman's body dumped near Krishna Public School in Karawal Nagar. Despite efforts to identify her, the deceased remained unidentified until the postmortem revealed that she had died due to suffocation caused by something tightly wrapped around her neck. The police launched a murder investigation. Upon reviewing CCTV footage from the area, the police discovered two men on a motorcycle with a woman sitting between them. However, due to poor camera resolution, the motorcycle's registration number was unclear. Nevertheless, the distinctive striped t-shirt and white trousers of the passenger provided valuable information. The police were able to trace the route taken by the motorcycle assailants to the Telivara area of Farsh Bazar, approximately 12 to 13 kilometers away. On April 20, the police obtained additional footage showing a man in a striped t-shirt carrying a girl's body on his shoulder, accompanied by a woman walking closely behind. The man and woman in the footage were identified as Vineet and his sister Parul Choudhury, while the deceased was identified as Rohina Naz, also known as Mahi. When the police arrived at Vineet and Parul's house, they found it locked. Neighbours informed the police that the siblings had recently moved out one after the other, and it was discovered that Parul had used a horse-drawn carriage known as a Tonga to transport her belongings and two children. The carriage was traced to a stand at Loni border and the owner informed the police about the house where he had dropped Parul and her children approximately 7 kilometers away from her previous residence in Telivara. Parul was arrested on April 21 from her residence in Krishnanagar. During interrogation, she confessed that Vineet and the deceased Rohina, who were in a relationship, used to live with her. The police revealed that Vineet and his father Vinay Pawar had been previously convicted in a murder case in Bagpath in 2017. Vineet was released on bail in November of the previous year. The police stated that Rohina had been pressing for marriage, which Vineet's family opposed due to her belonging to a different community. According to an officer, Vineet and Parul decided to sell Rohina, but when she became aware of their intentions, she fought back. This led the siblings to plot her elimination. On April 12, Vineet strangled Rohina after an altercation and concealed her body in a divan. In the evening, Vineet contacted his associate and together they transported Rohina's body, with Vineet carrying it on his shoulder while Parul carried a chunni and other clothes used to cover the corpse. The police quickly realized that the woman captured on CCTV was in fact Rohina's lifeless body. Vineet and his associate drove around with the cops between them for over 12 kilometers before finally discarding it outside a house in the darkness of Karawal Nagar. Parul was the first one to be arrested, while Vineet, who had fled to his village in Kakripur, Bakpat, and his associate were apprehended later.